we are The stars have been eliminated. Well, most of them. Count them out! Big game, Jesse P. See you later. On Jabir, back to Africa. Bonjour, como tal, vu, Carolyn, and Coco. Casaquina's out of there. The hard-hitting Belinda and Kuna Matova had to catch a flight. Vamos! Paula Badosa had to say adios. Kavitova ran out of gas. Krachikova and Maddie Patty. Big Mama Stepankles out of there. Anastasia got a little sloppy long head. Don't care! And BB stole the show with her outfit, but she's got plenty to try on now because she's eliminated. And only four ladies remain who will make the finals here in the desert. From Warsaw, her footwork so good she could win Dancing with the Stars. Five foot nine, 21 years old, she's a top ranked player in the world. But it's been like that the last year. What's new? Last year she won the Indian Wells, she's the defending champion. She then went to Miami and made the sunshine double look like a routine day at the beach. She did it so quick, she didn't even need sunblock. She's Iga, big bad Iga. She's come through this tournament taking out some pretty stiff competition. She took out former top junior Claire Lou in straight sets. Former Indian Wells champion BB on the beat couldn't get her drums banging. She demolished BB in two. And US Open champion Emirata Kanyu had no answer for the footwork from Iga, big bad Iga. Serrano Sorstea won a set last time they played, but she couldn't even sniff out one this time. Iga's Fiantek will take on someone that recently beat her at the Australian Open. Ouch. But I'm not done. Iga's so good, she could have been a professional swimmer. This is her second favorite sport. Whoa. She's winning 80% of her service games, 58% of her return games. She gets 70% of her first balls in play, and she's breaking opponents at a whopping, astonishing, amazing 61%. She is saving 36% of her own break points. Six foot tall from Kazakhstan. She's got more aces than Vegas. 116 to be exact. This isn't basketball, but she goes hard in the paint. She's 23 years old and already has a slam title. She said she doesn't feel like a slam champion, but trust me, your opponents know. She's won seven of her last 10 matches and we've seen wins over Karolina Pliskova, Bianca Andreescu, Marie Buskova, Sofia Big Game, Kennen, Paula Badosa. Vavara got bounced out of there. She might be looking to be a resident of Kazakhstan as well. And she took out Karolina Mokova in three. She was no match for the hard-hitting surfer. And when she goes for ice cream, they always ask for the soft serve. She took out Jabur at Wimbledon because she couldn't turn it on. Whoa, that was a good one. She's winning 83% of her service games, 28% of her return games. She gets 76% of her first balls in play. She breaks opponents when they're pressured at 45% and she is saving a whopping, astonishing, amazing 61% of her own break points. But the question is, can Iga's fiance get revenge? We go to the scorecards for a decision. From Warsaw and
Still. The reigning BNP Pariva Open Champion, Igor's Fiantek. At least for one more round. I like Iga's footwork to be too much for Elena. Last time they played, Iga was mentally out of it. But not today. This is good energy. I want to thank you all for 1.5 million. You're the real winners. Gas up the jet. We're headed to Miami. <laughs>